<clears throat> Let's start well. Hello, my lovely creatures from Indica Ilvestaro. Today is 15th of July, and I thought I would do a reading for the new, uh, second new moon in Cancer, which is uh, 20th of July. Because um, it is very important, this is very important time anyway, to everybody. Uh, this is not uh, science specific, this is for collective, uh, this reading uh, is for all signs. And, um, you know what messages are for you. And, um, which are not for you because every single message cannot be for you. You will know which are and which are not. And um, it's about divine timing. I said this is around new moon, uh, 20th of July. But this can happen like next month. Or last month, but it has been very powerful time. Uh, all the eclipses, eclipses, and, and these two moons, uh, two new moons. Now, uh, big things are happening. Um, lots of energy shifts. Um, everything is just um, feels so highlighted, kind of. So. I would say you can accept ex exit, yeah. Um, some sort of a change in your situation, in some area of your life or every area of your life uh, around like a um, three month, six month period, at least. But I would say like something will change in your life dramatically um, before Christmas so let's see what do we have for my lovelies for the collective moon in cancer 20th of July 2020 2020 I'll pull you one card from the museum Fairy Tarot. So let's find out what messages you guys are meant to receive. Thank you. So we got seven of autumn, which is uh, seven of pentacles. And bottom of the deck, nine of spring, which is nine of wands. Um, some of you You are worried about what you have achieved. Some of you, this message is not all of you, so take what resonates. Um, some of you are worried if you haven't achieved enough. I feel like you've been going and going and going and working and working and working and still you're not satisfied satisfied still you feel like you haven't done enough and exactly you feel like you haven't done enough you have done a lot you have done too much uh, regarding your own self i think you have lost yourself somewhere um, middle of the 
part when you was just going forward, going forward, trying to make something happen, trying to do something, anything, just to keep moving. And now what the new moon is asking you, the energies are asking you, you have to slow down, take a three deep, deep breath, count your blessings, look around you and uh, first and foremost, um, take care of yourself and know that the seeds you have planted, it's been a little while ago, uh, they are about to bloom, they are about to bloom very soon and even though you don't maybe see the results yet, the, the blooming yet, the fruits yet, it's coming and it's coming fast. And it's something, you have tried to achieve something so much like, um, like, Wanting to distract yourself, maybe you have a broken heart or some other problems with relationship with yourself, with a friend. Uh, anyway, you have a problem or something you want to distract yourself uh, you don't have to do you don't have to do anything about it if you are uh, focus on your work or focus on just going and going and going and trying to achieve something but this this what you are fuck, <laughs> manifesting soon what you are about to receive soon uh, it's something like which actually makes you feel um, that it's an achievement. You actually feel um, you have done something important. I'm going to take that. So no more distracting yourself. No more focusing on wrong things. It's time to stop. Take a deep breath and focus on yourself and the things that do bother you so much you have lost your way hmm. bottom of the deck we have a knight of pentacles if you have a finis uh go see my um finis reading as well there was a knight of pentacles there as well then we have this one dropped, um, page of cups. Okay, uh, there is a blank card. It's I uh, usually take it away. Uh, this is like where I cut the decks. It, it, it's not supposed to be there. I'm going to pick one more card. But then we have nine of pentacles reversed. Two of Cups. So, you can be um, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Earth element, or you might be dealing with one, or you could be Water, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Anyway, as I said, you have uh, trying to work towards something. towards something uh, from where you would want to see, you would want to um, receive like um, real, real like fruits, like you want to see in 3D that what you planted, what you wished, what you hoped, what you prayed, it's happening, but I think you have lost, like lost your hope in some way, and you wouldn't want to think that uh, which you don't have, so you have just like distracted yourself by focusing on wrong things. But you are getting there slowly but surely. You are getting there. Uh, it could be doing something with the home, 
moving. Uh, I see gardening. Gardening, you might do uh, do some gardening, some of you. Anyway, we have page of cups. Uh, love message, feelings of love. Uh, receiving uh, emotions. Uh, somebody might come and reveal their emotions towards you. And there is element of surprise here. Can you see the fish? Fish uh, coming out of the cup. Like what the hell that fish is doing there? That the hell. So I think uh, it'll come as a surprise for some of you. Someone is uh, coming. Could be apologizing to... Um, yeah, also, uh, maybe for some of you. Anyway, we have also two of cups. Soulmate cards. Marriage card, finding a uh, true love. If you are single, I think there is someone who admires you, who have been looking you, uh, maybe a little while now. And they might come forward. For some of you, this is... Um, is this could be an exist existing relationship or existing um, situation. Hard to explain situations with somebody, but I um, people come to their sense now, you know, uh, the new moon, new moon, this new moon in Cancer. Cancer is all, all about home and emotions. And so um, this new moon opens a door. For new love. Nine of Pentacles reversed. Uh, upright. Uh, sometimes it can signify um, a single card. I think some of you are not going to be single for much longer. I said uh, some of you might be moving. Maybe maybe you are moving together. Um, Let's clarify, but this new moon definitely brings some um, hope changed, changes. You've been waiting for, maybe waiting for so long that you almost gave up. You distracted yourself, you overdid, do, overdid, overdo everything. And it's like... Love is not for me, I don't deserve love, I don't even want love, maybe you have thought like that, but nah, everybody know you're lying. <laughs> At least I do. But, fuck my head. But it's coming, definitely. And you, you have been uh, very guarded, you have had your guards up, maybe you still do. But this one who comes towards you uh, is sincere. They mean no harm. Cards. Oh wow. Okay, um page of cups was clarified with uh, reverse nine of wands and this is the second nine of wands. Nine of spring is the same as the nine of wands. So yeah, someone is giving up of the resistance. Wounded warrior has maybe you have actually gone through a heart a heartbreak. You've been grieving and you got hurt so badly. You maybe didn't even want to uh, try to find a new love, trying to find an anybody. Or at least that's... Um, I keep hearing this like, um, you was lying to yourself. Sweetheart, like... 
everybody wants love, everybody wants to be loved, and everybody deserves to be loved. You deserve to be loved so badly. And I do understand that whoever hurt you, you have to put up these um, fences, you know, guarding your heart. But this dude who is coming, you will know they are sincere and genuine offer and you can put down your guards. It's safe to love. It is safe to love. And then two of cups was clarified with an empress. Um, Libra, Taurus energy. Doesn't have to be. Because she is ruled by Venus and Taurus and uh, Libra. Uh, Venus is signs. So, this is the queen of all queens. Uh, this is not, um, it doesn't matter if you are male or female or something in between or something else. Uh, this is the energy of abundance, uh, prosperity, of making things grow, making love grow. May uh, yourself feeling worthy of love, making yourself knowing you are worthy of this love, of this divine connection which has been meant to you. Making everything grow, um, making everything beautiful, giving birth to new ideas, new ventures, and this is for some of you um pregnancy some of you can become a mother and congratulations about that this is very very beautiful you guys and uh, uh nine of pentacles reversed was clarified with four of swords Yeah, I think you should definitely go watch the um, Finnish reading as well, if you just have a finish. Uh, there was a little bit of this to like, uh, being in a fork. Uh, don't know where to go, which way to go, when to go. And you have been doing it as well. Soul searching, meditating, contemplating, rejuvenating. Um, uh, partly because of you haven't known where to go, and partly because you have been so distracted of this, of doing everything else but you. And soon you realize the new moon will show you it's all about you now. What makes you happy, and when you are happy, it will come back to you and make you even more happy, make it grow, make it grow. But you have been, lo uh, this is not a bad card, kind of, but it, it's, it's not movement anyway. It, it, they have been like, um, where to go, when to go. Why? Or should I even go <laughs> anywhere, you know? But you are definitely going. And um, for some of you guys, you are really moving. Some of you, you are moving. And uh, it could be a house uh, from the countryside where you can uh, do gardening or maybe uh, vegetables or something. I can see that for some of you. But yeah, this offer, it it comes by surprise, I think. I think it might come uh, very quickly, like out of nowhere. Um, and this could also mean like you might have to consider like, 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 give me please a moment to think about it, <laughs> kind of, because it, 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 it comes so sudden. It comes so suddenly, but you know you want this, you know you, ha you deserve this, and you know 
this is your toolpath. And I know it too. So I hope this helped. And if you like the reading, um, please hit the thumbs up. Hit the cute bell so you get notifications of new videos. I'm about to come back at least um, like end of July with um, August readings. So you don't miss those. And if you want to book a personal reading, the instructions are down below. And um, as always, stay safe, take care of yourself, take care of each other, and I love you always.